What is up ladies and gentlemen, we're back here for yet another episode and as you guys can tell by the title, I'm actually very excited because I've got a package right here from, uh, this is actually from Tackle Warehouse, I didn't order this directly from the Guggen Squad because I have one more uh, soft plastic in here other than Guggen Baits, but this is consisting of eight packs of Guggen Baits and one pack of uh, Strike King Rage Crawls. So um, I've got this pretty pretty good size package here, and uh, we're gonna go ahead and open it up. If you guys haven't already, uh, if you guys want to purchase some Guggen Baits, they're down in the description. I've not even affiliated with them at all, but they are some of the hottest baits on the market right now. So. You can go get some if you want to. The link is down there. But um, also check out Imitator Baits. And if you guys get some of these uh, Guggen Baits, they are great trailers to add to an Imitator Baits jig. And uh, you can find the link to that down in the description as well. And Fly South Apparel. You guys go check them out. Go check out their website and at least give them a follow on Instagram. So we're going to open up this box and uh, we're going to see what's inside. <laughs> guys so you all just saw that uh, a quick little montage of me swiping the blade across the glorious tape and the box and cutting it all open so now let's get in to the box itself let me find my receipt um, I actually haven't even checked to make sure they sent me the right stuff I just plan on them sending me the right stuff so um, we've got the return label and we've got the sticker right here that's pretty pretty sweet um, so then we've got the uh, Got the shipping thing right here. And uh, my total order was $53.41. So, and everything was $5.99 except for the Strike King Rage Tail Baby Crawls. So, I'm gonna go over those first because these are like the odd ones out of the group. But I got these specifically for creek fishing because I got some new shaky heads that uh, they're like three sixteenths and one eighth of an ounce so the really small shaky heads meant for like I got them just for creek fishing so and these fit perfectly on those uh, those shaky heads so that's pretty much what they are right there they're just the rage crawl um, in a smaller version so and I got them in watermelon red flake because that's a pretty good natural color nine pack right there so now we get in to the glorious Guggen baits right here I mean Oh yes. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I've got a couple packs of repetitive baits and then the new baits. So uh, we've got two packs right here of the Bandito Bug. Here's one in Watermelon Red Flake right here. That's a seven pack. Um, and then this is a Bandito Bug uh, Black and Blue right there. Um, this is also a seven pack. Um, if you guys want to see my individual reviews over these, the three types of crawl baits, um, the, these, those are the baits that I've already got. Um, I've got re, uh, individual reviews over them, and you guys can go check that out as well. So now we'll get on to the cracking crawl. These are probably personally one of my favorite baits, um, if not my favorites, because I use these for Texas rigs, and jig trailers. I, you could flip with these. You can use them for a lot of different stuff. Um, so I got two packs of those as well, one in Watermelon Red Flake right there. These are very similar to the uh, Striking Rage Crawls. Um, and then I also got them in Baby Blue right there. Here's the Guggen Baits Kraken Crawls. Um, and the, the other ones are the uh, Guggen Bait Bandito Bug. I can't really even remember if I said that part. Um, sorry if I didn't. Um, and then the next one, these are the uh, Guggen Bait Trench Hogs right there. Um, they're very similar to a bigger, the bigger style brush hog. So, and these are uh, in Bama Bug. So, um, that's a new color. Those are all new colors for me. Um, and then we get into the baits that I have never used before. Um, when I originally ordered Guggen baits, I only ordered those three style crawl baits, and I only ordered one pack of each. So, I now have all the Guggen baits, um, and they're talking about coming out with some more. So, I'll get those too. Um, but this is the Goonbait's Drag and Drop and uh, Sunset Bug right there. 
Um, I'm going to take these ones out of the package just because uh, most of my, you guys, my viewers and everybody, uh, I haven't shown you guys these through my camera and what I think about them. This will be kind of my first impression if I ever get the bag open. It is freezing cold out here and my hands are going numb a little bit. So, that is the uh, the drag and drop right there. Sunset right there. It's got kind of like a orange underbelly with like a brown top belly thing. This would, they people have used this on shaky heads, um, drop, uh, drop shots, and uh, what's the other bait? Uh, a Ned rig, because you could cut off the first like quarter inch right there and make it a flat surface and then you can put that on a Ned rig and this little tail right there will go crazy. Um, so that is, that's the uh, Guggenbaits drag and drop. And the next one, this is pretty much the bigger version of the drag and drop. This is the Guggenbaits slim shake and uh, I got this one in Alabama crawl. So I will show you these as well. So this one is a very similar uh, color, I guess you could say, to what I got in the drag and drop, except for the top is like a green pumpkin right there. And then the underbelly right there is kind of an orange. But this one would work really good on a shaky head. Uh, you could throw this, um, you could probably throw this on a drop shot. You might be able to cut it down a little bit. A big Ned rig. Um, you could probably wacky rig this, throw it on a Nika rig. You could do a lot of riggings with this bait. So, um, and I'm actually going to be doing individual reviews over each of these three new baits, for me at least, um, in upcoming videos. And uh, I'll be going over good rig rigging, good r types to rig these baits. So, you guys stay tuned for that. So, that is the Guggen Baits Slim Shape. Last but not least, we have the biggest of them all, the king of them all, the Mondo Worm. And Lake Fort Guy loves this one. Um, this one is in Red Bug. So this is kind of like, uh, well, I guess lots of companies have Red Bug. So let me show you this one. This one is just like a, this is pretty much a ribbon tail worm. Um, and it's got like that flange on it as well to where it kicks really well. Um, and if you guys remember whenever I went down and met Scott Martin down in uh, Hot Springs, he actually talked to me about this bait and I hadn't used it yet, but now I have the chance and I can go give him my honest feedback because I'll probably meet him again this summer. So this is, this is it. I can't even really fit it all in frame while focusing to you guys, but that's that's it, it's got some really good ridges right there and everything. Um, and then that, that tail, it's got, ooh, just look at all that action. So that's that's pretty much all the Guggen baits that I got. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's little unboxing. It's freezing cold, like I was having a hard time opening the packages because it's cold. So um, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe. Make sure to go check out Imitator Baits. No, no. Go check out Imitator Baits. Go check out Fly South Apparel. These hats right here, super comf comfort, comfortable. And uh, also, they also have some really awesome uh, shirts as well. So go check those out as well. Link is down in the description to both of those companies. And thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you guys on the next episode of LMB Nation. Peace, guys. You're all good at giving baits. All right, peace.